Well, gee whiz, what are we gonna play today? Another fucking Ed and Eddie game! Lunchroom Rumble. Oh, this was infamous, and we all know why. But we'll get into that later. So all you gotta do... Oh, no. My GF... Well, not my GF, my person, my ca that character that l could resemble my GF. Should sh she be, you know, like 20, you know, not, I'm not referring to... Her. Marie can't or anything. Just ignore that. Oh fuck. Oh god. Don't even give me a, a fucking chance. Just like fucking go at it. Oh god. Jesus Christ. Oh what? I, okay, so I I'm, I use the special jawbreaker attack. Like you collect jawbreak these special jawbreakers and I eat it. <laughs> I get fucking loopy as shit and nothing really happens. Oh god. Yeah. So the game always had the the most easiest fucking exploit is you just wait here for the uh for the things to respawn, and eventually you'll get health or whatever. Oh yeah. Okay, that stuns them for like a few seconds, but you get stunned too. So what's the fucking point? Uh, yes. See, I mean, just one little health pack just fills you up all the way. So all you gotta do is just stay in this corner, and you'll be fine. There's no. <laughs> it's the easiest exploit of all time. Well, no, I'm sure there's more, but. Uh. Just gotta keep reusing these things, so the thing will, will- oh yeah. Yeah, so we'll just wait here. Fuck you, like, I, I, why is Ed attacking me? Like, I thought we were into this together. I thought Ed would at least be supportive of me, but no. I guess you just can't trust your own fucking friends in a food- <gasps> Oh my god! Did you see that? Holy shit. Hang on, let me just say, remember the level code, crowbar. It's a little violent that you have a level code that is called crowbar. Uh oh. Here it is. There she is, the best character. But it's such bullshit that, uh, yeah, okay, so the whole, in Ed and Eddie, the cartoon series, like we never saw what was under Double D's hat and that was always like a running gag. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck, Marie? I guess Marie doesn't like jawbreakers. Bitch. Ugh. I Get away from me, Ed, you fucking asshole. Like, I love her running animation. <laughs> but yeah, so in the show, it was always a mystery, like what was under Double D's hat. I always thought it was like a, a deformed twin or maybe his brain was exposed, but it was never revealed. Like uh, Danny Antonucci, the creator, said, hey, uh, you'll get find out what's underneath Double D's hat in the movie. Which, yeah, the movie came out, the, the uh, big picture show, and we never saw what the fuck was under Double D's hat, so it was a bunch of bullshit and fucking lies. Ugh. So just... But for, for this game, it, it's not, it doesn't count, it's not canon. I mean, it's not like they went to Danny Antonucci and said, hey, uh, what's under Double D's hat we're gonna put in the game? No, this was just a Flash game made by some, probably some intern who barely who's learning Flash, you know, and just pumped this out and said, hey, uh, they told, Cartoon Network told him, hey, draw us a, a celebrating animation or something, and he drew Double D throwing his hat in the air, not realizing that you're not supposed to know what double, what's under Double D's hat. It's bullshit. Just fucking bullshit. What, what is this attack Marie does? It looks like she's swinging a crowbar around. <laughs> <laughs> Which would be very useful in a, this lunchroom situation, like, <laughs> I mean, I'm, like, just imagine, like, this game, like, everyone's just having fun, having a nice time, and then this bitch comes along with a fucking crowbar, smashes people in the fucking head with it, brains flat, flat out on the floor, spilling out their head, cracked skulls, holy shit, just like, hey, this was supposed to be a nice little food fight, but no, you just had, you just had to ruin it for everybody, fuck you, Marie, blue-haired piece of shit. Okay, who's the next character we unlock? Just one? I got three before, now I just get one unlockable character? Fuck that shit. I want to play the best character again. But this reminds me, like, uh, I don't know, did anyone actually have been in a food fight at, like, a cafeteria or whatever? Like, okay, we sort of had one in my school. Idea Donna. And, okay, so these guys... They decided to just like say food fight and start throwing food and one of the teachers said hey stop And then those guys just stopped because no one else joined in it was fucking pathetic Like that was the worst food fight in the history of the universe like sure I may have not been 
to there to see every single food fight ever in the history of the world. But I'm pretty sure that one, that one that I happen to be in, was the fucking worst of all time. Because, wow. Just like, there, there was, they didn't try. They did not try. It was just like, food fight, throws a, like two pieces of food, and teacher yells at them, it's done. That's it. That's all. It was a fucking waste. Like, you, you see all these movies where a food fight happens. I think, uh, Max Keeble's big move. And, and you think it's gonna be fucking amazing. But no. We, oh, we can move the chair. Holy shit. Uh, move, move the payload. Oh, I got butt rammed. Sorry, you were eliminated. Oh, well, I guess that's the end of this game. Wait, let's look up some cheat codes. All right, so this game actually has uh, codes. Uh, continue, buffet. Uh, I guess I gotta start over with the shitty characters. So yeah, if you input buffet, you get instant, instant food, just endless. Come on, yeah. I, I was expecting it to be like rapid fire or something, like you could throw a billion at once, but no, it just reloads instantly. Oh, uh, well. I get, well, that was fun for like 10 seconds. Now let's uh, let's play this one. Ed, Ed and Eddie's Candy Machine Deluxe. Oh yeah, so it's basically like the uh, crafting game in um, Bioshock. Okay, lay the pipe down. Lay the pipe. Yep. Um, where's the curve pipe? Oh! Oh, I forgot yet to scroll through these. Oh, okay. Oh, let's just get rid of all this crap. We spent like $20 on each pipe at Home Depot, and this is all I get. But I remember, like, uh, yes! This, uh, oh, I haven't seen this in such a long time! Yes! Oh, because each one had always had a different animation. Yeah. So that was unnecessary. Okay, so it's like the pipe game, pipe dream, like that one Bioshock game. You know, when you're hacking in the first Bioshock, and this is it. But but it's a game, well, well I, I forget what it was called. I guess it was called Pipe Dream. I don't know, it's one of those games that existed forever, and everybody rips off, and nobody knows the original name to. You know the one. That's what this is. But except, uh, you know, that game, Pipe Dream, always had, like, you know, stuff happening. You know, like, the, the liquid was flowing through the pipe as you build the pipe, so there was a sense of pressure you know yet you you had a sense of urgency to play the game and you know do it instantly or else but here it's just like hey uh build it as long as you want whatever yeah <laughs> holy shit that's disgusting where the fuck did they get that from like there's only 12 kids in this universe so i'm assuming double d must have chopped someone open and fucking harvested their organs Jesus Christ, Double D, what the fuck's your problem, man? Oh my god, don't fucking trust him, shit. Double D, Double D's nuts. This is the game. I mean, I guess it's just like, hey, this looks interesting, you know? I mean, there's no pressure to beat the game under a certain time limit or anything. It's just, uh, you know, play the game, see the wacky animations. Oh boy, this is gonna be so appetizing to eat this... Yeah, cook the jawbreaker and just fucking burn it. Get, gets eaten by a robot. Here's a jawbreaker. Go fuck yourself. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, I fucking won that one. Great. That was the easiest one of all time. Yeah, let's see what else I unlock. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, you know, it's a fun novelty. There's no challenge or anything. Cause you, 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 this is the whole game. This is it. Uh, let's see what else you got here. Cause I'm vaguely remembering some of these. Uh, but now, I, just to, but I have to like, play the entire, every single level just to know what each of these things do. Uh, and you can't, what sucks is you can't flip the things, so you, Ah, uh, they're all so oddly specific to the shape. Yay. Yay. Drop. You know what? 
Okay, guys, if you're not gonna go reach the fucking jawbreaker yourself, I guess you don't- you, just, you don't- you just don't want jawbreakers! Here, look, one left? Well, just for one. You gonna do anything? You guys gonna do fucking anything? You're just gonna stare at that trash can? So I'm gonna drop it! I'm gonna fucking drop it! Well, gee, there. Are you happy? You happy? Fucking Eds. Christ, those fuckers. Those lazy ass motherfuckers. <gasps> Ah, looks like they gave, a uh, Cul-de-sac 2 Wheels of Fury a sequel! I didn't know this one happened, but- Oh! Let's see, space. So, I- like, people in the comments were saying that this one actually has weapon select. Okay. Mmm, there she is. Oh, they all have special abilities. <laughs> Nothing like having two by four friends as a best friend. Damages nearby cards, repels nearby enemies. A fart attack. Let's see. I don't want to know what fluid that is. Cry baby. Hard to drive with tears in your eyes, ain't it? Is that the new Melanie Martinez song? Oh, you can get... <laughs> Rolf, his special attack is calling Victor. The, uh, goat. And what the... F triggers an earth-shaking tantrum. Wow. Oh, I thought that was like... It looked like diarrhea from there. But uh, calling all cankers loves... Look out, Ed's... All boys take damage. Oh, this is- Oh, you mean to tell me this attack is worthless against girl characters? <laughs> like, they're so worried that someone will think, Oh no, this game has gay undertones. Like, fuck you. Great, now the attack is worthless against all female characters. I've already forgot what button did what. I mean, what, what's the special button? Okay, same, same strategy. Just circle the thing. Circle the thing. Like, they can't fucking attack me if, if I'm just circling. They'll never... They'll never anticipate this. Oh, man. No. Oh. How do I... Okay. Yay. Heterophobia. Oh, it's such a bullshit. Like, they could have easily done it for all characters, but no. They, it only works for the female characters. I mean, for the male characters. Well, I guess also the cankers won't be affected since that, that'd be a little weird. Oh god, are, are they related? I mean, I know they're the canker sisters, but you, they don't have the same hair unless they dyed it. I, I don't know how hair works biolog biologically. It looks like the only people who survived are the canker sisters, which now my, my special attack is fucking worthless, so. Uh, thanks for nothing. So yeah, they basically recycle much of the assets from the first game. But this would make a pretty good a standalone game, I guess. I mean, this is basically Grand Theft Auto. You know, the classic Grand Theft Auto with, uh, where it's top-down, except nothing like Grand Theft Auto. I mean, this ain't an open-world city, it's just... Oh, what's that bottle? Uh. I'm so fucking useless! Yeah, you whore! What is this? I guess it was part of the other cars, but I can't pick it up. It looks like a Voss or a hair, the hair dryer that's my that has my thingy on it. Oh, just circle around. Let's see you try something, bitch. Ah, oh, okay. Shit, she's just waiting for me to stop circling. That way she can just butt ram me right here. All right, let's build my my dream mobile. Spend as little as possible for maximum profit. That's the way a true businessman rolls. Please name your own cart. Did they ace cart? New cart. Fuck okay, it, it's called new cart. Where'd the new cart go? Is that it? Wait, was that it? Oh, oh, okay, hang on. Fuck. The interface is a little weird, so, okay. Select the thing. Big fucking thing. Ugh. Cart cunt. Cart cunt. All right. Cart cunt. Look out, Saddam. Mm, look at my fucking big wheels. Oh yeah, and the drifting actually makes a circle. Like yeah, it looks. It actually looks circular. My drift. My my drifty things. Yeah, they're never gonna fuck me now. Mm, yeah. Who's gonna be the first one to suck my dick? Yeah. Although, if you play this game, like, you can just... Oh, what happened? I got a makeover. 
<laughs> oh my god, so her power, like that, the blonde girl's power is to change my fucking car into some sh shitty pink car with all my, with, that's downgraded. I don't have all my special abilities. What the fuck? Some bullshit this, oh, okay, now I got my normal car back. What sucks is you can't colorize the car, sadly. Like, that's the thing every single customizable thing needs is to change the color of the thing that I want. Like, I hate how a game is like, hey, here's this thing, but it only comes in this color. Like, Saints Row got it right, where you can pick, like, a trillion different colors for the thing you bought. But here, just, hey, here's this ugly green car. Green's a great color and all, but I, I'm not feeling it today. I want something, like, purple. I'm always feeling purplish. That's what I want. Ugh. Oh, I'm. Why am I so slow? In my car, not me mentally, but <laughs> that does count. Also, that that question does pertain to that. Okay, Ed's trying to. Ed's the only one here. Let's just try reversing and forwarding. Mm, yeah, Ed. Oh, fuck you, piece of shit. Oh, like, I, don't, I can't imagine these kids are wearing seatbelts, so I imagine their heads just being clunked against the, <laughs> the dashboard and everything ultra-violently. Mm. No, I got rammed from the back! <laughs> no, my my weakness! Oh, oh, ass rammed. Oh, God. Happy International Women's Day. I got butt-fucked. Go to the garage. <laughs> Repair 81 cents. Okay, let's do this. You know what, I'm just gonna mind my own business, stay in the corner. No, just stay over. No, leave me alone! I, I'm, I promise I'm not gonna hurt I'm not gonna hurt anyone, leave me alone, no! No! Uh, hang on, it's hard to reverse. Okay. Well, I... Oh no, I'm getting <laughs> fucked! Help me! Why can't I move? I'm stuck! Well, I, I glitched and now I'm trapped in the wall. <laughs> Oh, well, at least my thing can still dance. Mm, help me! Someone butt ran me so I can at least get unclipped. <sighs> oh. <laughs> oh, it's like playing. It's like going to the carnival and you like you go on a fucking bumper cars and like your car doesn't work and you're just forced to sit there while everyone else has fun and you're just here. Oh, fine. Oh, I'm back and it looks like I got butt rammed out of there. Oh yeah, take that Lee, or Marie, no, Lee. Yeah, turning on her own sister, it's so sad. I remember the time when I turned on Emily. <laughs> no, I mean, I turned, no, I, hang on. I remember when I, <laughs> hang on. I remember when I turned against her, I didn't turn her on, my own sister, Emily, no. <laughs> I mean, I, I, you all think I, I did that on purpose, but I really didn't, no. It could be a, a Freudian slip, as they say. Yay, winner. Alright. Go to the garage. Give me money. Let's see, $8. Surely now I can afford the best parts. Oh, it's just a couple of cents off. Mm. What the fuck is this blender? Come. I'll call myself the Come Calamity. <laughs> Damn it! It doesn't fit. Oh, I could have sold the things. Fuck. Oh, I could have had that extra money. <laughs> Sell all my possessions. The cum calamity. <laughs> yeah. Oh, let's just ruin this fucking track field in the school. Look at my car. It's bigger than everybody else on the fucking road. Holy shit, they should be fucking terrified of me. Yeah, motherfucker! Mmm, yeah. Jesus Christ, it's like driving the a, an army tank through a bumper cart field. It's so sad. This is like a one-sided fight. These people do not stand a chance. What's that fart noises? Oh no, I, it's her power changed my thingy again. This is bullshit. Help me. Uh, uh, I got this little pussy pink car, and it's farting at the same time, it's shooting out hearts, I don't know what to do, well... <laughs> you know, I don't think you people understand the, the amount of work I put into these Let's Plays. Like, I don't really put in that much work, it's just me bla blabbering on. Oh, look at... 
Look at who's fucking trapped in a wall. How the turntables. Well, let's fucking ram this motherfucker right against the wall. Okay, I didn't really... That wasn't as, as awesome as I thought it would be. Let's try again. Oh, no, he got, he got free. Yeah. Damn you, Double D. Five whole fucking dollars, the championship derby. This is it. This is where the dreams, this is where dreams are made. Like this, this is the final match. What, what do I call my cart? The nuts smack, damn. Nut smasher. Oh man. Speaking of nut smashing. Okay, let's see who dares challenge me. Speaking of nut smashing, like have you ever thought, you know, just how hot it would be just to like, I don't know, going back to the, the topic of uh, being beat up by a, a girl, preferably one with blue hair and one that's edgy and like gives the middle finger off in her selfies, you know? Like I was thinking like, damn, it'd be pretty hot to get beat up by one. Like I remember I was a long time ago, like 2010, 20, 2009 or so, no eight, like early YouTube. Like I thought, man, Street Fighter is an awesome game, and all these chicks are fine. And I thought, holy shit, it's almost did someone just release a demon? Holy fuck, was what the fuck was that? Oh, and I thought, wow, these characters are fine. Like I wish they would just beat me up. Like I don't know why. Like what occurred to me? Why was I thinking that? Yeah, these characters are hot. I want them to beat me up. I don't know why that happened, but you know, it happened. There's no changing it. Can never go back to how I used to be normal with normal kings. But the idea of getting beat up by a girl, yay! <sighs> Look who's number one yet again. Oh no! Fuck! Okay, so there will be one in the comments told me like oh, last last time I was complaining like you can't. Look, the game erases all your data and you go start from zero. Look, she's got a trophy. She's the best. You start from zero and you lose all your money, but they told me that th there was actually an option <laughs> to select. Th there was two options. There was start over and play again. And I was like, no, like, it seems so fucking easy to mix that up. Like, that's a terrible design choice. Oh my god. Like, at least give me a warning say, hey, if you select this, uh, all your data is going to get erased and you have to start all over. Like, uh, give me a warning, like, because I just naturally click on whatever's next. <sighs> Yeah, but this is the end of the game. Let's just end this off by getting butt rammed by all sides. Please, please, fu please, just en just end it. Finish the game. Well, I guess this is the end of the game. Goodbye, every pony. Goodbye.